Okay, something that I am working on is experimenting with ribbon mics on my saxophone. I have done a lot of recording using condenser mics, and these oftentimes will bring out a harshness on my saxophone, especially in the upper register. Uh, they're very good mics, but at least the ones that I've been using a bit um, do bring out some of this harshness. So I'm looking into ribbon mics to see if they work well with my saxophone. So I'm going to be trying out three mics today. Um, they're all somewhat similar in price range, kind of low to mid price range and maybe $200 to $500 range. So I'll be trying out the SE Voodoo VR1, the brand new Royer R10, and the Cascade Fathead. So check it out. Let me know what you think. I know I'm going to be studying these like crazy to find out which ones bring out the qualities of my horn that I like the most.
So ultimately, each of these microphones sound great to my ear. They all have very subtly different characteristics. Uh, some are a little truer to the actual sound of the saxophone. Others kind of uh, shape the frequencies a bit in different ways. I think some are very obviously different from one another. And as much as I think a transparent sounding microphone is important, like you want a microphone to capture the sound of the instrument, especially if we're going for an acoustic vibe and I want the mic to actually um, pick up the true sound of my saxophone, then of course transparency is something that we look for and, and that's uh, what you pay big bucks for in these high-priced microphones. However, I also think there is some merit in choosing uh, the coloration of a microphone that you think works well with your sound. And so that is something else that I'm listening for here is not just what is the most transparent, but which coloration do I personally like the most with my saxophone sound? So let me know what you think, and I will uh, reserve judgment on this video, but um, in future videos I'm sure you will see which microphone uh, or microphones I am using primarily with my saxophone. So stay tuned if you want to see which one is my favorite.